Amy Caraba is live at Manteca Ford, and more info about where the proceeds from the purchase will go. Hey, Hi, Amy. Amy. Oh, you look That's good. That's a neat-looking car. Hey, natural. <laughs> okay, I know you're jealous, Ken. You know put I Put the am. drool in your mouth, Ken. Just put it back in. Push it up. This car worth... $1.5 million mm. over that. Just amazing. 270 different jewels in this car. We're talking rubies, sapphires, emeralds. I'm sitting on the inside. I found one of the most expensive things. This right here. Do you know what this is, guys? Uh, well, it looks oh, yeah. like an air freshener. Air freshener. Any air idea? freshener. Yeah. <laughs> this is just the air freshener. Oh, okay. That's worth about 99 cents. The rest oh, of the okay. car, though, it's very expensive. Phil Water for joining me. This car, I've never seen anything like this in my life. It's it's quite a car. It's quite a ride. I got to tell you. You know, you want to you want to float like a butterfly and sting like a bee. Here it is. <laughs> yeah. Oh, like Muhammad Ali would say, right? So owned by Muhammad Ali. Let's talk about the history of the car. What's the backstory? How the car was? Who created it? Why was it created? Well, the car was originally designed, um, and it was it was earmarked for somebody in the royal family. Um, what's interesting about this car is all the gold that you see on it is 23 karat gold from the bumpers to the grill to the front headlamp covers, uh, the door handles, even the accelerator pedal. All of the, uh, in the interior, all the buttons and the knobs and the switches, it's all 23 karat gold along with mink. Uh, that's primarily mink is what you see, the, the carpeting, wow. yeah. uh, the, uh, the steering wheel cover. Um, it's quite a car, and then you're right. Over t over 270 precious jewels, oh. diamonds, rubies, sapphires, um, and even emeralds are encrusted into this vehicle. Even just the paint colors. Obviously, Muhammad Ali, a big humanitarian, so the paint colors represent like world peace. You've oh. got ocean, forest colors, sort of combined. Correct? Right, right. You're right. You're exactly right. They're all earth tone colors, uh, representing humanity. All the wonderful, beautiful complexions of the human race, representing humanity, is in, is in, ingrained in this vehicle. So the cost of the vehicle is what? The cost of the vehicle was estimated at $1.5 million, and we already have an offer right now of $500,000 from the U.S. tool company wow. right. that is on the table. So, um, you know, we're, this is going to go to auction very soon, and 100% of the proceeds are going to go to fight global world hunger. Which, which is, is what Muhammad Ali wanted. That's his wish. That's his wish. Uh, so, uh, first off, I want to say this real quick. Kind of explain how you got the car here, because I love that it's here locally, and it's such a great story, why, why you have it. Well, you know, it's interesting. There was a story, a local story that went national about a young man, a young kid who's 16 years old who found a wallet. The wallet had over $2,000 cash yeah. in it. He did the right thing. He turned it in. We heard about it. We wanted to reward this young man, offer him a, a $6,000 college scholarship to any university that he wants to go to, also a paid internship at the dealership, along with a uh, one of the hottest gifts of the year, PlayStation 4. And basically, Muhammad Ali's people saw that a dealership was doing something good, and they said, we're going to give you the car, and that's why you have it featured on Pawn Stars. We're going to show you more of this right. coming up. It's going to be here at Phil Waterford's Manteca Ford for another week. You can view it. People are coming from all over the world, you said, coming here just to see it. I can't wait to show you what's in the trunk. It is a huge secret, and it goes tick, tick, tick. It might, it's not a bomb. Wait a minute, okay. wait a minute. Oh, right. oh, it's okay. very right. cool. I can't there. wait to show you that coming up. All right, Amy, that's a. <laughs> Welcome back to Good Day Sacramento. Amy Caraba live here at Phil Waterford's Manteca Ford. This right here, Muhammad Ali, he formerly owned this vehicle worth $1.5 million. It's this Mercedes. It's unbelievable. Phil Waterford joining me. So many details we've talked about in this car. Over 270 different jewels in it. What would you say is the most unique feature on the vehicle? Wow, the most unique feature. One thing that I'm really partial is when you look at the way this car was built, it has crushed diamonds that are all encrusted into the paint of this vehicle. Um, and then also when you look at the actual color scheme, you see all the earth tones, the the sand, the oceans. The Arabic writing, talk to me about that. Well, there's a lot of Arabic writing on the car and those are many popular verses from the Holy Quran. Really? Yes. I love this. Okay, let's go to the trunk because this was quite interesting. In the back of the trunk, guys, there's a tire, which would be normal, yes. but this tire is very unique because there's that a clock a, in it. Yes, that's actually a world clock, and it's it's also 23 karat gold, and it has uh, very precious jewels as the, around the bezel. I mean, even the detail on the trunk. This is the most bling bling trunk I have ever seen, <laughs> just with everything on the inside. Recently, you were featured on um, uh, I'm blanking. 
Pawn Stars. Stars. Yes. Pawn Stars. Yes. What a fantastic show. What did they think when they saw this car? What was the reaction on the TV show? Well, you know, they looked at it and they were like, what is this? And I explained that this is a car that was previously owned by one of the greatest world sports icons and global humanitarians, Muhammad Ali. Yes. And I think that got their interest when I said that. Yeah. <laughs> and then they believed you. You showed them everything. I'm sure that they, I'm sure they wanted to buy it. You think that they'll get, make an offer? Well, you know, the, the show is going to air in about 30 days. And when it does, we've already received some offers. And I think we're up to $500,000. Yeah. But the great thing is 100% of the proceeds goes to fight global world hunger. And that was the wish of Muhammad Ali. Which I love. Okay, one other thing. Let me show you the inside here. In the back seat, I noticed there's like a mirror. I, at first, I was like, is that a PlayStation? But of course, it's not. <laughs> what is, just talk to me about the back seat. We haven't really shown that. Well, you know, first of all, Muhammad Ali really enjoyed driving this car. However, he also preferred to be driven. And so in the back, I think there's a little vanity mirror and uh, it has curtains. Was that for him to check his teeth? That was for him, you know, because he, <laughs> really? he, he said his face was so pretty you didn't see a scar. And that proves <laughs> that he's the king of the ring by far. Oh, my goodness. I love this. Okay, so people can come view this car here. It's going to be here for about another week, correct? That's correct. That's correct. And I mean, what such a one of a kind car. Every little detail. Let me just show this. I just noticed this. It looks like there's even jewels here. There are. I mean, it's everywhere. There are. There, there really are. And you know what's interesting about Muhammad Ali is many years ago, he, obviously he was very flamboyant, um, said a lot of really interesting, colorful things, yeah. were even things that were controversial. But as he got older, the things that became more important to him weren't material. It became more about humanity yes. and helping people. And that's why I really appreciate, you know, having an opportunity to have this car on display so families can come, they can take pictures with it, they can just see a part of history. Yeah. And hopefully somebody will make an offer, $1.5 million. It'd be nice if someone made an offer more than that. All the proceeds right? benefit to fight the uh, world hunger. And it's just amazing. So again, you can come here, Phil Waterford's Manteca Ford, the next week and see the car. Thank you All so right. much for showing it. Appreciate Thank you. it. Thank you. Thank you. You can Can't put a down. You? you can put a down payment on that, Amy. You look fantastic in that car. Just go ahead and leave him a down payment. <laughs>